What's up guys, Christopher Walker here back again with another video. Today we're going to talk about Thermo Mindset Principle number three. Now if you want to check out the other ones that are here on the channel, I'll be releasing all five Thermo Mindset Principles here in different videos. Um, and if you're wondering what the Thermo Mindset is, it's basically I'm, I'm writing a new book called The Thermo Diet and I'm talking about how the strategy that I used uh, to drop 30 pounds in 12 weeks and I did it with very little effort basically it didn't feel like a diet and I'm, I'm calling it a thermo diet just because you know that's what people respond to they, they think you know diets but it's much more than a, just a diet it's much more than just a nutrition protocol it involves an all-encompassing mindset shift a worldview because when you do that mindset shift which is one of the principles I'm going to talk about today everything else just naturally falls into place because as, as I've said in one of the other videos on the mindset everything starts in your mind and if you get that right, everything is easy. If you, if you are looking at the world in the, in the correct way, if you're, if you're basically creating this internal reality for yourself uh, where you're playing games that you can win, then everything is enjoyable and, and success becomes a lot easier for you and you stop being a victim to the world and you become a creator, you become a cause instead of an effect. So today, what I'm going to discuss is the principle about vibrational energy, about just the fact that everything is energy translated through different um, different sources, essentially. Even matter equals, equals mc squared also proves to us that energy really is just concentrated matter. So let's talk about vibrational energy today. If you are interested in, in reading this book and being the first to know about this book, go over to thethermodiet.com. I'll put a link in the description as well. And uh, if you go over there, there's just a, I'll have a waiting list up over there. You just sign up on the, on the waiting list. I'll send you an email when the book comes out. It's going to be out in early 2018. And again, it's very, very paramount. I think the most important chapter in the book, more important than the nutritional protocol, is the mindset chapter. So that's why I'm devoting more time and energy to, to you know, promoting these ideas because they're, they're good ideas. I think they'll change your life. So let's talk about vibrational energy. Now, the important thing to notice is that actually nothing is at rest. Everything is moving, everything vibrates. All states of matter, both visible and invisible, exist on a continuum of vibrational energy. Every atom, molecule, and cell inside your body is vibrating in a certain motion, speed, and frequency. Now, the combination of these frequencies from the micro to the macro level of your organism results in the physical form of your body right now. Every physical object is in a state of constant vibrational motion. Think back to elementary school science class when you learned about the different components of an atom and how the subatomic particles are constantly moving. Now, the wave function of electrons is actually a probability. This constant vibrational motion translates from the atomic to the universal level, as above, so below. As the energy flows from the atomic to the molecular, to cellular, to tissue, to organ, to organ systems, then ultimately to the organism level, you must remain mindful of this translation. Now low energy states on the cellular level are going to translate to the higher and lower levels. So you don't want to have low energy states on the cellular level, you want to have a high energy state on the cellular level. Now, many people choose to pursue diets, habits, and vices that leave them in a low energy state on the cellular level where this vibrational energy ends up manifesting forms of disease, stress, cancers, and negative physique changes such as excess body fat storage, estrogen production, and muscle tissue wasting. To achieve vibrant health, you have to nourish your cells to produce as much energy as possible since this vibrational energy translates above and below. It's gonna reflect itself throughout every level of your body, including your brain and your mind, since your biological body is really just a physical vessel for your psychological mind, and therefore your perception and experience of the world that you live in. And when you accept this reality, it'll become natural for you to concern yourself only with ways of thinking, habit patterns, and nutritional choices that encourage high vibrational energy, which will lead you to a more rapid evolution of your body and mind. I know there's a lot in that concept that, you know, this, this cellular energy is going to translate up to the organism level through all your tissues, your muscle, everything. Basically, if your cells are producing a lot of energy, then you're going to you know, reap the benefits of that. But if they're in a low energy state, you're gonna suffer the consequences of that. So, 
If you want to learn more about this, uh, go and, and definitely sign up to get on the waiting list for the book. Uh, it'll, it'll be out early 2018, thethermodiet.com. Uh, if you want to learn more about the other mindset principles that I'm going to be talking about here on the channel and other videos, uh, this was principle number three. There's, there's one through five. Uh, just subscribe to the channel, like the video, and uh, find that playlist. I will see you on the next video.